Hey, welcome back everybody. It's Johnny. Some big news. South Korea is not going to ban cryptocurrency. So as we saw back in September when China said they were going to ban exchanges and ICOs, Bitcoin went from, I believe, don't quote me, somebody's going to check the actual facts um, down on the comments, but I believe it roughly went from, Bitcoin went from 7,000 to about 2,800, all because China was saying they were going to ban, but then later that didn't happen. And then we have Binance. Um, so South Korean government reaffirms that there will be no trading ban for cryptocurrency in the short term and nothing is finalized. A petition to fire the head of Ministry of Justice over the cryptocurrency trading fiasco has also been fired. So this is extremely good news. Um, if we go in a little bit deeper, 60,000 citizens voted in the petition to fire the head of Ministry and what did he say? He Then the ministry himself uh, released a statement that he does not support or agree with the decision to ban cryptocurrency. So he's either trying to save his job or um, you know, trying to be on the right side of the news. And what's interesting is they say in South Korea back in 2016, the former president is currently having jail time for money laundering and corruption charges. And there was millions of South Korean citizens that came out to the streets and it surrounded their blue house until the court decided to finally process the impeachment. So the citizens have a lot to say in this. So um, I'm sure they had a lot to do with it not being banned. And it just goes back to tell you that buy the rumor, sell the news. And there's a spokesperson of the South Korean Cryptocurrency tax f Task Force that he stated that uh, they need to follow the roadmap regulations for big cryptocurrency uh, countries like Japan and the United States. And he also said he's going to follow the regulatory frameworks and trends established by other leading governments. Yeah, I, we just went over that. And then there is certainly a negative reputation, repu, repu excuse me, um, attached to the cryptocurrencies like Ponzi schemes, pump and dumps, um, people, ICOs, not all of them, some of them just crowdfunding and then take your money and run with it. So that's all really, really good news. Really, really good news. It's good news for the market as well. Uh, the market is in green which is really, really good. We're on our way back up. I know everyone's been panic selling. You know, Tron was at all-time high about 28 cents. Now it's at 10 cents. Correction is healthy. I've been waiting to see where the bottom of the dip was going to be, and it looks like we potentially are at that bottom of that dip. So nothing is for certain. It looks like it's hit a resistance, and we're going to have a, a small uptrend going on here so there is some coins that i'm interested in purchasing as we saw one of them was was nav coin um, i don't believe i'm going to make a purchase of nav coin and i'll tell you why if i could search properly and we can already see that the market cap is going up people are starting to purchase everything that's on sale so it's nice that um this whole South Korea thing happened because now you can buy some coins that you thought that you missed out on before. Um, this guy selling at $4.51. Man, I wish I would have gotten in when this guy was under a dollar. But all-time high, almost $5.491. Market cap is relatively low, so there's still room here. The supply is extremely, extremely low. These guys are 100 in, is that 10, 119? What market are these guys on? Binance and Bittrex. Um, I do like these. This is a, a for sure maybe maybe for me. Some of the other ones that I was looking into was this guy. I believe this guy's either on Binance or where's this guy on? Bittrex. Um, 46 cents. I think this guy's all-time high. $2.16. Market cap's a little bit higher than I'd like. Max supply as well. But they had a correction and they're, they're coming back from it. All-time low, 38 cents. 
So um, just for just for the month. That's just all time low for the month. Uh, all time low, low, low. This guy is point zero 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 five. So it's still it's gone up quite quite a bit. All right. Um. I think the biggest one I'm excited to purchase is this A and B. This guy dollar and one. And da, 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 da. where is my information here? So all time low is thirteen cents. All time high a dollar eighty two. So there's some room here. Low market cap, relatively low supply. Where is this guy on? Binance. All right, I like the tech. This for me is a definite purchaser for me. Oh, there is there is one more that I was looking at. What was that? Um, Air swap. That's what it was. I believe this guy's on Binance as well. Binance. Yep. And then this guy's starting to have a little bit of uptrend. All time low, eighteen cents. <clears throat> so he's up relatively 300 percent or so since um, his all-time low but all-time high two dollars uh, market cap still fairly low total supply half a trillion <laughs> half a billion sorry half a billion half a trillion what, did, what was i saying half a billion this guy is probably another one that that i'm going to put a, a small position out on as well so Anyway, guys, this is Johnny. Hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know. Like, subscribe. I have some comments. I like reading them. Till next time. Bye. And now I know my